Dr. Panda. Hello, Dr. Panda. Toto. Please tell us what will you be doing today. Dr. Panda, let's go. Dr. Panda, uh oh. No task too big, come bring your friends and let's play. Fighting fires, fixing tires, you always save the day. Out of groceries, hey, no worries. Dr. Panda's on his way. Dr. Panda, Dr. Panda, hello. Come on, let's go and have some fun today. <laughs> Hi, Dr. Panda. What are you going to do today? Hi, everyone. Today, Ziggy is playing a game of golf, and I'm going to be his caddy. <laughs> What does a caddy do? Well, a caddy helps out and carries this bag. All the stuff Ziggy needs to play golf is in here, like balls and all these different golf clubs. <laughs> Yay! That's right, Toto. The ball goes into the hole, and our hole is way over there where the flag is. <laughs> And whoever hits their ball into the hole first wins. Hey, Dr. Panda, I just have to beat Olette today. Will you help me? Well, of course. That's my job. You have to promise you'll do everything to help me win. It's just a game, Ziggy. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. But she's won every game we've ever played. Please, Dr. Panda. This is important to me. Okay, I promise. I'm surprised you wanted to play again. You weren't too happy when you lost the last time we played. I'm gonna win this time, you'll see. Have a good game. This club is perfect for hitting the ball a long way. Thank you, Richie. <sighs> Wow! Good shot, Olette! Your turn! <laughs> You'd better hope I don't hit it in the hole on my first try. <laughs> Sounds like it's gone in the bushes. Uh, Have you found the ball? Nope, still looking. Uh. Oh, uh, I found it! Turns out it wasn't in the bushes at all. It sounded like it was. We heard a rustle. Uh, maybe that was uh, a, a bird. Uh, pass me another club, would you? Uh, okay. <laughs> oh, I think I should do that hit again. That's against the rules, Ziggy. Come on, Dr. Panda. You promised to do everything to help me win. I did say that, didn't I? Uh, okay. Yes! <laughs> ha! That's better. Ha! Your ball went in the long grass. It's going to be tricky to hit now. Your ball went in the sand. <gasps> oh, no! This club is perfect for when the ball is in the long grass. <sighs> oh, there's no way I'll catch up with Olette now. Unless... <clears throat> hey! Huh? Ziggy, you're only supposed to hit the ball with the clubs. But don't you want to win fairly? <laughs> I guess so. Here, this club should help you hit the ball out of the sand. <clears throat> See? <clears throat> We're close to the hole. Be careful of the water. <clears throat> <laughs> Hitting the ball into the water means you miss a turn, Olette. Remember when you hit that tree, we let you take it again? How about we let Olette do the same? Are you kidding? This is my chance to win. Hmm. Hey, Olette! 
Do you need some help looking for that ball? I'm pretty sure it went in the water, Dr. Panda. Oh, let's just check. Hey! I found it! Huh? But we heard the splash. Yeah, maybe that was, um, maybe that was a fish. Thanks, Dr. Panda. What did you do that for? So you can have a chance to win. Fairly. Now I'm not gonna win at all. You can't still win, Ziggy. I'll help you, just like I promised. Oh, look. It's gonna take me two hits just to get round this silly bush. Oh, I have an idea. Aim for that tree over there. Huh? Don't swing too hard. Keep the club straight and aim for the tree. <laughs> oh, you did it, Ziggy! Wow! But now it's Olette's turn. If she hits her ball well, she'll win the game. This is my chance. The ground isn't completely flat, so hit the ball a little to the side of the hole. Okay, I'll try. Yes, you did it! Oh, I won! I actually won! Against Olet. Congratulations, Ziggy. You played very well. It was the best game of golf I've ever seen you play, Ziggy. And you won fair and square. Thanks, Dr. Panda. Hey, you're good at keeping the rules. Maybe you should be a referee. <laughs> I think that's an adventure for another day. See you next time, everyone. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Dr. Panda. Bye-bye. Today, I'm going to help Moo with a big pile of laundry. <laughs> Will you be washing stinky things? Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. That's a funny noise, Toto. <laughs> Bubbles. <laughs> oh, hi, Moo. Dr. Panda, please come now. Olette and Ziggy's washing machine is broken, so we have to do their laundry, too. Oh, there is so much to do. No worries. We're on our way. Are you coming, Toto? Hi, Moo. We're ready to get to work. Oh, thank goodness you're here. I've never seen so many dirty clothes in all my life. No worries. We'll soon have it done. Good. I'll hang this laundry on the line while you put the next load into the washing machine. Great. This is the laundry soap. It makes everything clean and smell nice, but it's very powerful stuff. Only put in one capful per load. Remember, don't put in too much. I won't. Let's get this machine going, Toto. <laughs> It's supposed to do that. <laughs> and it's definitely not supposed to do that. 
I'd better call Hoopa. Hoopa! I think Moo's washing machine is broken! Hi, Dr. Panda. I'll come round to take a look. I'm right next door. I've just fixed June's fridge, so I've got my toolbox right here. Awesome! Thanks, Hoopa! Whoa, boy! Oh, no! Easy fix, Dr. Panda. All it needs is something heavy on top to stop it from moving. See? Mm. Oh, would that sack be heavy enough? I think so. Oh, Dr. Panda, help me get the dry laundry off the line, please, so we can hang up the new load. Sure. Hoopa, can you put that sack on top of the washing machine, please? Dr. Panda! Leave it to me. has just finished. I'll put the next load in for Dr. Panda. That'll help. Oh, put that in there. Lots of this in here. Hmm. I reckon I can make the machine go faster. That'd help speed things up. Not forget to add this. <laughs> A little bit more, just to be sure. <laughs> 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 All done. I gave the washing machine a bit of a boost, too, so it'll go faster now. You'll be finished in no time. Oh, that's great. Thanks, Hooper. Yeah, thanks, Hooper. Ah! What's that? I don't know. It sounds like a machine of some kind. It sounds like my washing machine. Uh, Hoopa, did you remember to put that sack back on top? Uh, no. Well, don't just stand there. Go and fix it. I'm on it. <laughs> Turn it off! Ah! Whoa! It's gone mad! You have to turn it off before it wrecks the place! <laughs> How much laundry soap did you put in, Hooper? Uh, enough? This is a disaster! No worries, Moo. I'll think of something. Well, you better. Otherwise, my whole farm is going to be covered in bubbles. I can't even see where the machine is. The bus. <laughs> oh, that's it, Toto. I've got an idea. You have? You have? Yep, thanks to Toto. Moo, have you got those swimming goggles from your vacation? Um, yes. Hoopa, can you hand me those hoses behind you? Yep. Suds away. There. All done. <laughs> I hope Ziggy and Olet get their washing machine fixed soon. I don't want to have to do all that again. Thanks for helping out. 
No worries. Uh, but hang on. Wh where's Toto? <laughs> oh, you want to play dress up now, do you? <laughs> yeah. Well, that's an adventure for another day. See you next time. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Panda. Bye bye. Dr. Panda. Hello. Dr. Panda. Toto. Please tell us what will you be doing today. Dr. Panda. Let's go. Dr. Panda. Uh-oh. Test a bit. Come bring your friends and let's play. Fighting fires, fixing tires. You always save the day. All the groceries. Hey, no worries. Dr. Panda's on his way. Dr. Panda. Dr. Panda. Hello. Come on, let's go and have some fun. Hi, Dr. Panda. What are you going to do today? Oh, hey there. Today, I'm a detective. I'm trying to solve a mystery. What mystery? The mystery of the missing Toto. <laughs> Let's see if I can find some clues. <gasps> Look, footprints. I must be on the right track. <laughs> Where could he be? <laughs> there you are. Are you ready to be a detective, Toto? Yeah! Excellent. We'll bring our tablet so we can take photos and make notes. All we need now is a mystery to solve. Moo! Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no! Moo? What's the trouble? Oh, Dr. Pander, something terrible has happened. My carrots have gone missing. Oh, please come quick. No worries, Moo. Toto and I will solve your mystery. I picked my carrots this morning and now look. Hmm. Why would carrots suddenly disappear? I don't know. Are you sure you haven't eaten them for breakfast? I had eggs for breakfast. Eggs? Hmm. <gasps> Maybe someone yeah. took them. I don't think so. Who would have taken them? Someone who likes carrots, that's who. Oh, I know. June. She loves carrots. But June wouldn't just take them without asking. You know, Moo, sometimes things turn out to be quite different than they seem at first. Anything could have happened. <gasps> Maybe the baskets have holes. No holes. Has anything else gone missing from the farm? I don't know. I was on my way to collect some apples when I noticed... Oh! <gasps> my apples! Moo! Not my apples, too! I was going to make my special apple pie! Are you sure there's no thief, Dr. Pander? Not likely. This thief would have to be really tall to reach all the way up there. Olette! She could reach up with her trunk. But Olette is no thief. She would never steal your apples. Now, nope, something else must have happened. So, Moo, when was the last time you saw the apples? Uh, yesterday. Oh, yesterday. Maybe the apples got blown off the tree by a storm. But there wasn't a storm. Okay. Um, oh, maybe you already collected the apples and just forgot? No worries, Moo. We'll solve this mystery together. Oh! <laughs> look, look! Oh, what's this? It's a footprint. Well, whose footprint is it? Don't know yet, but I'm sure things aren't as they seem. <gasps> oh, my. Whoever this thief is, they must still be on the farm. First the carrots, then the apples. <gasps> Where else do you keep food? <gasps> the kitchen! Oh, at least my cupcakes are still here. I made them specially. They're my favourite. So, everything's still here, then. Oh! <gasps> my cupcakes! 
No! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! All my food gone! Right from under our very noses! This thief has a big appetite to want so much food. Someone like Hooper! That's ridiculous, Moo. Well, it must have been Bip then. He's fast, and he's certainly a bit of a rascal. Bip does like to mess around, but he's no thief. Sometimes things aren't what they seem at first, remember? Ah, a feather! Another clue! Let's look at what we know. First, there were the empty carrot baskets, then the strange footprints by the orchard, and now a feather in the kitchen. Hmm. No worries, Moo. We'll solve this mystery together. <gasps> Listen in the background. We'll solve this mystery together. Have you checked the chickens today, Moo? <gasps> My chickens! Oh, no! Oh, no! Someone's taken all my chickens! Remember that things can be very different from what they seem. Maybe the chickens went out for a stroll. I do hope they're all right. Oh, I know! We'll set a trap to find the thief. Ooh. Here's what we'll do. We'll tie the chocolate bar to the camera with string. And we'll get a picture of whoever takes the chocolate. All we have to do is wait. Oh, someone's here. Oh, they're too quick, Dr. Pander. We'll see about that. Oh, is that my chickens? But why would my chickens want to steal my food? I feed them very well. I don't know. But there must be a good reason. Hmm. Huh? Ah! Moo, look! Oh, my! <laughs> Oh, my sweet darlings! Thank you! Uh, Moo, I think it's time you enjoyed the special treat the chickens made you. So, there was no thief after all. <laughs> you were right, Dr. Pander. Things can be very different from what they seem. Oh, thanks for helping me today. And you too, Toto. Toto! Hey! That's a very nice picture. You should be a photographer, Dr. Pander. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's an adventure for another day. See you next time. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Pander. Bye-bye. Dr. Panda, hello. Dr. Panda, Toto. Please tell us what will you be doing today. <laughs> Dr. Panda, let's go. Dr. Panda, uh oh. Test a bit, come bring your friends and let's play. Fighting fires, fixing tires, you always save the day. Out of groceries, hey, no worries. Dr. Panda's on his way. Dr. Panda, Dr. Panda, hello. Come on, let's go and have some fun too. Dr. Panda, what are you going to do today? Oh, hi everyone. Today I'm going to bake cakes. Yay! Cakes! <laughs> oh, flour everywhere. Dr. Panda, have you found the flour? Oh, coming! Oh, thanks for helping today. No problem, Dr. P. This is so exciting. I love cakes. So, what do we do? Well, first we make the mixture for the cakes, and then we flavor them with these ingredients. Whoa. Oh, cool. Oh, hey, Toto. Are you working on your scrapbook? Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> that looks great! Oh, the first cake is ready. Let's see how it looks. Oh, this would be perfect with pink icing on top. Pink icing? No, no, no. Yellow icing is the way to go. No, silly. This is a raspberry cake. It needs to be pink icing. Mmm, cupcakes for lunch. I'll set them down here to cool off. Will you keep an eye on them, Toto? <laughs> Dr. Panda! <laughs> Dr. Panda! Oh, hi, June. What's up? I'm having guests over to see my latest paintings. I promised them a special cake. We could make you a special chocolate cake. Or a banana cake with yellow icing. How about a blueberry cake with pink icing? We can make any cake you want. You just have to pick what you like. Hmm, I know. How about all three cakes in one? Hmm, a super cake. We could do that. Super cake? I like the sound of that. You're the best, Dr. Panda. A real lifesaver. I'll come back after lunch to collect it. Bye! What if we each bake a cake and stack them on top of one another once they're done? I'll do the banana-flavored yellow cake. And I'll do the pink blueberry cake. And I'll do the chocolate cake. Yay! have to wait until our cakes are ready. Who wants a cupcake? Me. Me too. Oh, wow. Did you do this, Toto? Yeah. They look like the flowers from your scrapbook. They're beautiful. Mmm, and delicious too. Great job, Toto. <laughs> oh, so cute. Oh, our cakes are done. Time to make these into a super cake. Hmm, the chocolate cake can be at the bottom. Oh, my banana cake should go on top. But you'll squish my blueberry cake. On top! Left a bit. There. Now that's a super cake, I think. Phew. I'm back! Is my super cake ready? Yep. Oh, exciting. Hold on. Whoa. Here, I'll help. Oh. 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 Well, it still tastes delicious. But it looks like a, a mess. I can't give it to my guests like this. I have an idea. We'll make it into lots of little super cakes, just like Toto's special cupcakes. Yay! Awesome! Perfect!
amazing, don't they? <laughs> they sure do. They're real pieces of art. Thanks, Dr. Panda. Thanks, everyone. Well, I better hurry. Not long until my guests arrive. Wait, June! There's four cakes left. Those are for you as a thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Now that's what I call a sweet exit. Wow, this is delicious. I can taste blueberry. And I have one of your banana cakes, Bip. It tastes amazing. What flavor have you got, Toto? Chocolate. Oh, I am stuffed. Maybe we should go for a run, you know, to help our cakes go down. <laughs> I can hardly get up. That'll have to be an adventure for another day. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Dr. Panda. Dr. Panda, hello. Dr. Panda, Toto. please tell us what will you be doing today. <laughs> Dr. Panda, let's go. Dr. Panda, uh oh. Fantastic big, come bring your friends and let's play. <laughs> Fighting fires, fixing tires, you always save the day. Out of groceries, hey, no worries. Dr. Panda's on his way. Dr. Panda, Dr. Panda, hello. Come on, let's go and have some fun today. Hi, Dr. Panda. What are you going to do today? Hi, everyone. Can you guess what job I'm doing today? You're a dentist. <laughs> That's right. Today, I'll be checking people's teeth. <laughs> you have to be gentle when treating someone. Let's prepare for our first patient. Hi, Moo. Ready for your checkup? Well, uh, no. I mean, yes. How is Dr. Panda? Is he fine? Is he sick? Not feeling well, is he? Oh, well, I guess I'll have to cancel my checkup. I'll come back some other time. Dr. Panda's feeling quite all right, Moo. He'll be ready to see you shortly. Oh, that's great. We don't usually allow chickens at the dentist. She doesn't like to come to the dentist either, but it calms her when I stroke her head. Uh, take your seat. Dr. Panda will be with you shortly. Hi, Moo. Isn't the dentist fun? I've been brushing five times a day, front and back, top and bottom, and flossing after breakfast, lunch, and dinner, <laughs> and... Richie, time for your checkup. Yes! Oh! Hi, Richie. Please take a seat. Whoa! Your chair's wobbly, Dr. Panda. I know, but it's nothing to worry about. Let's get started on your checkup. Open wide, please. Your teeth are sparkling clean, Richie. You've been brushing them well. So, do I get a happy smile badge? Please tell me I get a happy smile badge. Oh, you've earned it. I'll see you at your next checkup. Oh, yes! Hi, Richie. Whoa, cool badge. Thanks. Hooper, you're next. I hope I get a badge, too. You're right after Hooper, Moo. Oh, it's okay. Take as long as you like. No rush. Ready for your checkup, Hoopa. Let's just bring the chair down a little. <laughs> your chair has a bit of a wobble, Dr. Panda. Do you want me to fix it? <laughs> well, if you don't mind, that'd be great. It's a bit stuck. Let me push down harder on it. <gasps> oh, can you hear that? What is Dr. Panda doing to poor Hooper? Thank you so much for fixing my chair, Hoopa. No problem. Open wide, please. Great. Ah.
Your teeth are in great shape, Hoopa. Thanks, Dr. Panda. Uh, so, do you have something for me? Here's your happy smile sticker, Hooper. Yes! Checkups are the best. Hooper, you made it! Are you okay? I'm better than okay, Moo. I'm great! Come on in, Moo. Hi, Moo. <laughs> I wasn't expecting you to bring one of your chickens along today. Are you sure it wouldn't be more comfortable in the waiting room? Oh, no! She's much more relaxed when she's close to me. Oh, well, that's fine. Come and sit in the chair, please. Oh, dear. She doesn't like going up and down. And she likes bright lights even less. Is that better? She certainly seems to be making herself at home. Oh, no! She doesn't like being at the dentist. No offence, Dr. Pander. It just makes her so nervous. Oh, I can feel her poor tail feathers trembling. Hmm. Are you sure it's not you who's really nervous, Moo? Me? <laughs> no, of course not! No! Well, yes. Oh. oh, I'm sorry, Dr. Pander. I just get so worried about going to the dentist. I feel so silly. It's okay, Moo. There's no need to feel silly. Why don't we put your chicken down, huh? Now, I'm just going to have a look at your teeth, that's all. Open wide, please. Achoo! Let Dr. Panda do his work. So, let's see. What? Oh! Shoo! Shoo! <laughs> Mo! That's enough! <gasps> I'm so sorry about my chicken. Ah, uh, no worries, Moo. I think your chicken's just a little bored. <laughs> an idea. Why don't we give her a checkup first? Open wide, please. Let's take a look. Ah, yes. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Looking very good. Well done. So, that's it? All done? Yes. You see, there's nothing to worry about. Are you ready for your checkup now, Moo? Yeah, I think so. Yes. Let's do it. Ah. Great. You see, having a checkup isn't so bad. Uh, what was that? Moo says she loves coming to the dentist now. That's right. <laughs> Thanks, Dr. Panda. Oh. <laughs> See you at your next checkup. Um, Dr. Panda, you do know that chickens don't even have teeth. <laughs> That's true, Olette. But the chicken's checkup helped soothe Moo's nerves, didn't it? You gave me that idea with your toy shark, Toto. <laughs> <laughs> Toto, doctor. Oh, you want to be an animal doctor now. <laughs> well, that's an adventure for another day. See you guys next time. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Panda. Bye-bye. <laughs>
Can you guess what job I'm doing today? You're a doctor. <laughs> That's right. And I've got a special patient to attend to. Uh, hey, Doc, can you take this thing off my leg already? I'm afraid not, Bip. This cast helps to fix your broken leg. Say, ah, uh, ah, uh, but I can hardly move with this thing on. <laughs> well, that's the idea. Ah, your temperature is fine. You need to stay in bed and move your leg as little as possible. Huh, for how much longer? A few more days. Wait, what? Days? Calm down, Bip. Your leg needs to rest so it can get better. Oh. oh, that's right. This came for you. Hey, a get well soon card. Hope you're feeling better soon, Bip. I hope Dr. Panda fixes your leg quickly. Get well soon, Bip, so I can beat you at basketball. Oh. Isn't it nice that everyone is thinking about you? I'll come and check on you later. Huh? Uh, Dr. Panda, wait! Uh, let's play checkers. Prepare to be beaten. Oh, I'm sorry, Bip, I can't. I've got lots to do. Why don't you rest a little, and I'll see you soon, okay? Oh. Mm. Hey, Bip, how are you doing? <laughs> Bip? Huh, Bip, where are you? Hmm. Toto, do you know where Bip's gone? Uh, uh, uh. Oh, we need to get him back into bed. Hmm. Maybe his friends know where he is. Hi, Dr. Panda. Hey, Hoopa. Have you seen... I'm glad you called, Dr. Panda. I get this funny feeling in my back when I twist around. I'll take a look at it later, but right now I need to find Bip. No, oh, he's helping me clean the fire engine. You did a great job fixing his leg, Dr. Panda. Woohoo! Oh, there he is, behind you. There's <laughs> my back. Uh, Bip, stop! <sighs> Do you know where he might have gone? Uh, he was talking to May May just now. Ah, <sighs> thanks, Hoopa. Oh, and take a nice warm bath. That should help make your back feel better. Thanks, Dr. Panda. Not bad. Not bad? I've been working on these moves all week. Well, it just needs some bip magic. How about a spin? It's an ambulance. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh, Dr. Panda? May May, is Bip here? Oh, well, he was. I guess he just ran off. Ah, any idea where he went? He said something about a game of basketball. Olette, thanks! <laughs> hey, not fair! Stop! Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh! My leg! Uh. <laughs> Are you okay? Uh, yeah, I guess. Let me take you back to the hospital. Okay. Ah! Everything sounds fine. If you keep resting, your leg will be as good as new. W wait, where are you going? Oh, I have to... Uh, hmm. I think I know why you keep trying to get away. Are you missing your friends, Bip? 
Oh, I hate being on my own. It's so boring. <laughs> hey, thanks, Toto. I have an idea. If you can't go to see your friends, maybe your friends can come to see you. <laughs> and then there was the time I rescued a cat from a tree, but then I got stuck and had to be rescued myself! <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny! Thanks for inviting everyone, Dr. Panda. No problem. We've worked out a timetable. I'll be here tomorrow to beat you at basketball. Basketball? Miniature basketball. <laughs> That's so cool. And I'll be here the day after to show you my new dance routine. I've decided to put in a spin. I taught her that. <laughs> we'll all take turns to visit you, Bip, to make sure your time here isn't too boring. <laughs> Thanks, Dr. Panda. You guys are awesome. I'm feeling better already. Wait until I beat you at Miniature Basketball. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see about that. <laughs> Hi, Toto. Are you playing with your friends, too? Nina, Nina. <laughs> oh, you want to ride in an ambulance, too, do you? Yes. Well, that's an adventure for another day. See you next time, everyone. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Panda. Bye-bye. Bye. Dr. Panda. Hello. Dr. Panda. Toto. Please tell us what will you be doing today. Dr. Panda. Let's go. Dr. Panda. Uh-oh. No task too big. Come bring your friends and let's play. Fighting fires, fixing tires. You always save the day. Out of groceries. Hey, no worries. Dr. Panda's on his way. Dr. Panda. Dr. Panda. Hello. Come on, let's go and have some fun today. Hi, Dr. Panda. What are you going to do today? Hi, everyone. Today, I'm a weather reporter. We work out what the weather is going to be like, and then we tell everyone about it. Hey, where's Toto? Toto is spending the afternoon at the farm with Moo. Oh, okay. It's time to go on TV, Dr. Panda. Are you ready? Yep, all set. In three, two... <laughs> Everybody, welcome to today's weather report. Today it'll be very warm. Ah, I guess I won't need to wear a jacket for my workout later. It will also be very calm with no wind at all. <laughs> Perfect weather for skateboarding. And finally, our weather equipment tells us there will be no rain. Great! That means I can work on my roof today. And that's the weather report for today. See you tonight for tomorrow's weather. <gasps> you did great, Dr. Panda. Well, with our special weather equipment, how could we go wrong? Uh-oh. <gasps> What's wrong? Uh, something's up with our special weather equipment. Come on. Uh -oh. Check the thermometer first. It tells us how warm or cold it is. Oh, Mimi, look at this. Oh, how cute. Oh, the mommy bird must have thought this was a good place to keep her eggs warm. Oh, but the nest is also keeping the thermometer warm. Looks like it's a lot colder than we thought. <laughs> I thought Dr. Panda said it would be warm today. I'm freezing. <sighs> Something else is wrong. The wind meter isn't moving. Someone's kite has blown up here and...
and got tangled up with it. Looks like it's quite windy today after all. <laughs> Dr. Panda was wrong! <laughs> Like this should be moving around, searching the sky for rain clouds. I think it needs some oil. <gasps> um, Dr. Panda, didn't you say there wasn't gonna be any rain today? That's right. Today, there will be no rain. Quick, get back inside. Finish my building work, so I need to know what the weather is going to be. No worries. Let me check. What? Ah! Oh, my laptop is broken. Mm. Rain and laptops don't mix. I need the laptop to tell me what our equipment is saying about the weather. Oh, I'm afraid I don't know what the weather is going to be, Hoopa. I guess. I'll just have to guess, I guess. I'm sorry, Hoopa. Oh. Dr. Panda! Dr. Panda! Hi, Toto! Hey, Moo! How did you know it was going to rain today? Our weather report said it was going to be dry. Well, Dr. Pander, I'm a farmer. I always know what the weather's going to be. You do? What equipment do you use? A thermometer? A satellite dish? <gasps> Weather balloons? <laughs> Don't be silly. I can tell from what I see around me on the farm, like the colour of the sky or how the chickens behave. Chickens know what the weather is going to be? Oh, you'd be surprised. <gasps> Moo, I think you'd make an excellent TV weather reporter. <gasps> I'll get the camera. In three, two, one. Good evening and welcome to the weather report. We are sorry to have gotten the weather wrong today, but... We have a special reporter with a better way of telling the weather. Over to you, Moo. Hmm? Uh, hello. <laughs> Let me see now. Uh, well, there was no fog this morning, and the bees have been out all day, so tomorrow it will be partly cloudy with a slight breeze. And the sky's red, so that means there'll be no rain tomorrow. Great! That's the perfect weather to finish my building work. But the chickens are huddling together to keep warm, so it will also be a bit chilly tomorrow. Don't forget to wear a jumper. I won't. Thank you, Moo, for your excellent weather reporting. It was my pleasure, Dr. Pander. I liked being on TV. Hey, maybe we could do a cooking program together. <laughs> well, that's an adventure for another day. See you next time, everyone. Goodbye, Dr. Panda. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye. Dr. Panda.
What are you going to do today? Uh, good morning, everyone. Today, I'm making deliveries. Can you guess what I'm delivering? You're a milkman. That's right. Milk. <sighs> it looks like it's going to be a hot day, Toto. Everyone will want some nice, cool milk. First, we have to go to Moo's farm and collect the milk. Moo! Moo! Let's go! <laughs> Hello? Moo! Phew, it's already getting hot. Moo! Where are you? Strawberries, Dr. Pander! So many strawberries! Oh, oh, hi, Moo. We've come for the milk. Yes, yes, it's over there. Oh, if I don't pick all of these strawberries today, they'll go bad in the hot sun. Hey, maybe Toto and I can help. Would you? Oh, you're a real lifesaver, Dr. Pander. Okay. First, let me put the milk in my van where it'll stay cold. Oh, I'd better turn it up a little. The milk needs to stay cool or it'll go bad in the heat. Ready to help, Moo! Oh, good! Let's start picking! a lot of strawberries. Oh, yes! More than I need. <gasps> Maybe you could take this extra crate of strawberries for your customers. Great idea. Thanks, Moo. No, thank you. Bye now. Bye, Moo. Bye-bye. <sighs> We're running a little late, Toto. Are you ready to start our deliveries? Yay! Right. Our first customer is Olette. Uh-oh. Dr. Panda! What's that? You heard something strange. Uh-huh. Uh, we don't have time to stop now, Toto. We'll have to look at it when we're at Olette's. Panda, I was just about to have my breakfast. Hi, Olette. Where do you want your milk? Oh, in the kitchen, please. Breakfast is my favorite meal of the day. And I've been looking forward to pouring this fresh, cold milk over my cereal. Hey, why isn't the milk coming out? Mm -hmm. Oh, no. I think the milk might have gotten a little too cold. I'm sorry, Olette. It's frozen. Frozen? But now what am I going to have for my favorite meal of the day? <gasps> oh, I know. Would you like some strawberries? <gasps> strawberries? I love strawberries. You have strawberries, Dr. Panda? I sure do. Freshly picked this morning. Follow me. Uh-oh. Oh, no. What's wrong? Uh, the strawberries are all squashed. That must have been the noise we heard. Squashed strawberries and frozen milk. Well, how is that supposed to make a tasty breakfast? I have an idea. Olette, how do you feel about a strawberry milkshake? For breakfast? Really?
goodness, Dr. Panda. This is the best strawberry milkshake I have ever tasted. <laughs> oh, let me get that. Dr. Panda, we saw your milk van outside. And you're late with our milk. Uh, I'm so sorry. We've been making strawberry milkshake. Would you like to try some? For breakfast? Awesome! You have to taste this. It's amazing! Oh, this is incredible! Delicious! Can I have some more, please? Sure! I'll add some to your delivery when I come around to your house. Yay! I should go. I have lots more deliveries to make. Are you coming, Toto? <laughs> See ya! Bye, Dr. Panda and Toto. Thanks, Dr. Panda. Ah, did you like your milkshake, Toto? <laughs> ice cream! Huh? Oh, you think we should make ice cream, do you? Yay! That's a great idea, Toto. Oh, yeah, yeah I love ice cream. Oh, yeah, yeah, I love ice cream. Yeah! <laughs> That'll be an adventure for another day. See you next time, everyone. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Panda. Bye-bye. <laughs>